welcome. In this video, we're going to take you through step by step how to pair and register your new Samsung Color e paper display. To get started, make sure you have your mobile or a tablet handy, have two gigabytes of memory available, and Wi-Fi and Bluetooth enabled. To get started, you need to download the Samsung ePaper app. To do so, and depending on which device you're using, you can either search for it in the relevant app store, or conveniently, you can scan one of the QR codes located on the ePaper display. Open the app and tap Add Device. You can scan the QR code located on the display, or you can tap Scan Nearby. Once you've located the device, you can tap on it to start pairing. Tap Pair two times to connect to the display via Bluetooth. You will see a pairing code on the display. Type this in. Now it's time to connect your device to your Wi-Fi. Choose your preferred network, enter the password, and tap Connect. You can also connect via a mobile hotspot or change your settings anytime under Wi-Fi settings. You will be asked to accept the smart signage privacy notice. Tap OK to agree or skip if you prefer not to. Now let's finalize your device setup. Choose manual setup to proceed. From here, select your screen orientation. You have the choice of portrait or landscape. Here is where you can choose a different type of sleep mode. We will leave it as the default for now. Here is where you can choose your protection time to be run. Every three days, it will do a refresh of the screen. By default, it is set as 1 a.m. From here, you can select how you would like to play your content. For now, we will leave it as the mobile CMS. Now, the final step is to change the pin number. You'll notice some flickering. This is completely normal as the activation is now getting the image prepared for your first content change. Congratulations, your Samsung Color ePaper is now activated and ready to go. For more information, visit our website or reach out to your local Samsung representative.